This isn't the point of the video at all, but this filter looks totally different in different like lighting situations and if she's not calling me out for not getting enough sleep, I'm moving right now and I am really tired. Whoa, did you see that? My light just went out. Here's the thing about Leo Moons. Ooh, that was, that was super aggressive. <laughs> Here's the thing about Leo Moons. Okay, the stereotype is that the whole world has to revolve around them, right? That they're super self-centered. And yes, the moon is how you feel inside. The sun is literally the ego, the center of the solar systems. One of the natural shadows is being self-centered. But that is, first of all, not the biggest shadow I've noticed with Leo moons. And second of all, that's really not what motivates them most of the time. The beautiful thing about Leo moons is that, and this is, I feel like this is never recognized about Leo moons, but... They see themselves as the sun, right? So I have found most of the time, a lot of Leo moons I know, literally kind of see it as their job to be the giver of light to their family, to the people around them. Like they kind of almost subconsciously see themselves as the life sustainer, the life support for the people they love, which for obvious reasons can be very self-sacrificial and not really a healthy perception either. But Oftentimes, like, they are just this little ball of light that is actively trying to help and uplift the people around them. And it's really freaking sweet. And I do not think they get recognition for that. So I just wanted to say that. Maybe I'll get some sleep now.